Deontay right. Morris to Jokic in the lane. Put it up. In sports and entertainment, when you hear the name The Joker, who comes to mind? There can only be two answers. One is Batman's greatest nemesis in the legendary comic book movie, and the other is Nikola Jokic of the Denver Nuggets. Jokic is as dangerous on the court as Batman's rival, because at 26 years old and at 6 foot 11 inches, he is at the peak of his powers and threatens to destroy the opposition with his bag of tricks. Handed it to, Isn't that funny? handed it to Rondo. <laughs> In this video, we will explore the top six things you need to know about the Joker's mysterious lifestyle and net worth. Number six, basketball contract and net worth. Nikola Jokic was born in Sombor, Serbia on February 19, 1995. He initially had no interest in basketball, but as he got taller and taller, his parents suggested that he play the sport as a teenager. He was also influenced by his two brothers who had played locally. The Denver Nuggets saw the rare potential and unknown quality that he would bring when they drafted him in the second round and 41st overall in the 2014 NBA Draft. He was seen by Ogden Stojevic, a Nuggets personnel involved in player development, as a mix of Mark Gasol and Dirk Nowitzki. The Nuggets seemingly did the smart thing by allowing Jokic to remain in Serbia for one more year. He followed up his draft selection by playing for Megalex in the following season, and showcased his talent by winning MVP of the Adriatic League. <laughs> That kind of play before the draft would have made him a certain first round, so Denver certainly had picked up a diamond from the rough. In 2015, Jokic burst onto the scene in his rookie season as an unknown to NBA fans. As a rookie, he averaged just 21.7 minutes, 10 points, an impressive 7 rebounds, and 2.4 assists. Yoke was never satisfied with his game and kept getting better and better in the development of his skills. By the 2017 to 2018 season, he was averaging 18.5 points, 6.1 assists, and 10.7 rebounds. He was now the focal point of the team because he played 32.6 minutes per game. The only problem was that Jokic wasn't being paid like a star player. On a second round deal, Jokic only earned 1.3 million in his first season, approximately 1.36 million in his second season, and 1.47 million in his third season. On July 9th, 2018, the Denver Nuggets made a wise but obvious decision to sign the Joker to a five-year, $148 million maximum extension. The extension meant that in one year, he would earn $24.6 million, and by year five in 2023, he will earn an approximate $32.5 million. CelebrityNetWorth.com has estimated that Jokic has a net worth of $30 million. He has continued to repay the Nuggets on their investment because in the current season, Nikola is the preemptive favorite for the Most Valuable Player Award and has the Nuggets being championship contenders. Fun fact! Nikola Jokic made the lyrics of the notorious big It Was All A Dream play out in real life on the night when he was drafted in 2014. With the six hour time zone difference in Serbia, Jokic was asleep when his name was announced as the 41st pick in the NBA draft. Therefore, his brother called him to tell him the great news. In true Joker fashion, he hung up the phone on his brother and went back to sleep, thinking it was just a dream. The Joker is now living the dream and bringing nightmares to the opposing players. Another nightmare. Uh, no. oh. Number five, fitness lifestyle. When Nikola first had an interest in basketball as a teenager, his coaches at Mega Basket Junior Team, his professional team in Serbia, did not let him practice because he was overweight. Jokic admitted that he used to drink three liters of Coca-Cola per day growing up and often had cheese pies for breakfast. This diet was a recipe for high calories and gaining too much weight. The strength coach of the team declared him obese when he couldn't do a single push-up. Wow, that is hard to imagine. At 6 foot 11 and over 300 pounds, Jokic was a versatile athlete playing multiple sports such as soccer, water polo, and volleyball. 
In fact, he speaks to the influence of water polo play that has enabled him to deliver his patented full court dimes. Eventually, as a teenager, he lost a bit of weight and showcased his talent on the floor. However, entering the 2014 draft, NBA scouts concluded that Nicola was unathletic and without muscle definition, which caused him to fall into the second round to the Nuggets. Before the start of the 2015 season, the Nuggets' strength and fitness team whipped Jokic into better shape that caused him to shed 30 35 pounds of weight to be better prepared for the pace of the NBA game. He brought his game to another level since 2020 when he admitted to losing 20 to 25 pounds during the season through diet and exercise. While the world packed on pounds during the pandemic, Jokic returned to the NBA level looking more slender and tone having lost an additional 3 to 5 pounds more. Jokic has certainly put in the work on his body, putting himself in position to be a potential Hall of Famer when it is all said and done. I'm not hanging out with them because they don't understand me. I need to say like seven times during the games, oh my god, you know, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Number 4. Endorsements As a young foreign player in the NBA, it is difficult to get traction early into your career and earn major endorsements. Jokic is estimated to be earning endorsements totaling $750,000 per year. He is reported to earn the sum from a shoe deal with Nike and an endorsement from Western Union. Just use your Western Union app and send him some money. The Joker is not only an endorser of the offerings with the Swish Apparel Company, but also adores what the company offers, especially the Hyperdunk series. The Denver Nuggets center slash power forward has previously donned the Nike Hyperdunk X, Hyperdunk 2016, and Hyperdunk 2017. He's also been spotted playing hoops wearing the Nike Zoom Rise in 2019. In the 2020 to 2021 season, Nikola Jokic's preferred sneaker is the Nike Zoom Rise 2. This bouncy unit provides tons of energy return when running and landing. The fabric upper is coated with a textured print for added durability. At 26 years old, Jokic is just about to enter his prime, and is therefore primed to get a signature shoe deal that his play on the court richly deserves. Number 3. His wife, Natalia Marcesic. On Saturday, October 24th, Nikola Jokic married his longtime girlfriend, Natalia Marcesic, in a private ceremony in Serbia. Nikola and Natalia began dating in high school and decided to tie the knot in their hometown of Somber. The wedding was heavily guarded to ensure it was a private occasion and was initially delayed due to the COVID outbreak. While Natalia is a private person by nature, a look at her social media account shows that she had accompanied Jokic on a trip to London when the Nuggets played against the Indiana Pacers in January 2017. Some photos that were taken by the couple also date back to when Jokic was only 18. Natalia was loyally by her man's side as he made the transition from Europe to the United States by making the move as well. When she came into the country, she earned a degree in psychology from the Metropolitan State and appears to have plans to pursue a master's degree. The lovebirds certainly spent several years getting to know each other before marrying and have a bright future ahead together. Number 2 Philanthropy. In 2019, Jokic and his then teammate Gary Harris worked with the NBA to bring the Basketball Without Borders program to his home country of Serbia. The Basketball Without Borders is a program associated with the NBA and FIBA, which is focused on being an outreach program to help bring basketball to young kids all around the world. By successfully spearheading this venture, Jokic proved that his heart is in the right place by giving back to his community and connecting with the younger generations. When the coronavirus pandemic began in 2020, Jokic's home country of Serbia was not spared the devastation. It is reported that the dire situation moved Nikola to make a significant donation to the Dr. Radovav Simonovic Medical Center, a hospital in his hometown, to help fight against the virus. When he donated the amount, Jokic made a personal request that the amount of his donation not be made public. Nikola didn't even want the news of his donation to go public at all. What a humble guy. Number 1. Cars and Horses One of the first vehicles Yoke purchased was a Jeep GMC Yukon in Serbia. The vehicle is spacious and big, which makes it ideal for the Serbian center at his enormous height. It has a powerful engine and can go up to 100 kilometers in 5.8 seconds. It was reported in November 2020 in Serbian media that the Joker upgraded his wheels when he purchased a custom-built Mercedes-Benz G63 Brabus. 
The car is said to have cost him 250,000 euros, or the equivalent in the US of just over $300,000. The interior is luxurious, with the manufacturer making the interior at the request of Yoke. The car is built with 800 horsepower and accelerates to 100 kilometers per hour in just 4.1 seconds. Speaking of horsepower, Nikola Jokic is a big fan of horses. As a youth, Jokic would find it thrilling to ride and care for the thoroughbred animal. Whenever he goes back to Serbia, Jokic may still even clean the stalls at his friend's stable. In 2017, Jokic was asked, if he wasn't an NBA player, what profession would he be? Jokic's response was, I'd be a stable boy. And no one doubted his sincerity, because in 2016, Jokic bought a racehorse named Dreamcatcher. The horse even won a race in the summer of 2017 in Serbia, with Joker and coach Mike Malone there to celebrate. Yes, Nikola Jokic, the kid from Eastern Europe, is indeed living the American dream, with a big heart, a big NBA contract, endorsements, cars, horses, and a beautiful wife by his side. Let me know if we missed any aspect of Joker's lifestyle and what you think of him as a player. Please smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. Until next time!